For practice it, self-check 2.20 receipt. We are told that the following program repeats the same expression many times. We need to modify the program and remove all redundant expression using variables of appropriate types. We're looking at our first two lines, which is three and four. These look fine. And next is five. This looks fine. What needs to change is this um, print line right here. Instead of printing out all of these values, 38, 40, and 30, we can cut this and paste it in a int that we can store. We can call this sub and set that equal to all of these values and then just print out sub like this. Next we have tax. So instead of printing all of this out, we can just say double tax is equal to sub times 0 0.08. And then instead of printing out all of this, we will just print out tax. For tip, instead of printing all this, we just have a double and we can call it tip and set that equal to sub times 0.15. So that gets rid of all of this and all we need to print out is tip. Lastly, we have total. We can, we have this 38 plus 40 plus 30, which is the same as sub. So we just have this and we can combine these lines together. There's no reason for them to be separated like this. Makes it a little bit easier to read. And now we have 38 plus 40 plus 30 times 0 0.08. Well, this is the same thing as tax. So we can highlight all of this and then just replace it with tax. And this is being added to 38 plus 40 plus 30 times 0.15, which is the tip. So we have all of this. Instead of printing it out like this, we can actually store this in another value. So we can cut this and um, paste it in double. And we can call it total. Let's set this equal to oops, sub tax tip, which is like this. Once we have all of this, we can just print out our total and see what we get. And we have passed the test. So this is basically just making the code smaller, easier to read, and easier to reuse um, if we were to reuse it for future lines, if we were to expand this code.